what is up it's your girl i am back with another video glass house maya and today i'm gonna be talking about some hair products that i use on my locks okay so if you're here and you're subscribed to this channel because of um you want to learn more about how to maintain locks okay then i thank you for being here if this is your first time watching this channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button hit that thumbs up button and leave me a comment down below and go ahead and tap that bell notification so you can be notified when i upload another video so i'm just gonna hop right into okay. the video so the first thing um first of all let me say that i have been locked for two years two whole years in the game okay my hair is currently in a braid out i just recently hit two years uh on january the 9th and what else what else do i need to let you know about my hair um i started with two strand twist i also um have 4c hair okay that kinky hair that kinky hair that do like this you know it ain't no curls it just kind of do all of that um so and i have like fine hair as well so and what else what else do you want to know um i have around 64 locks in my head as well but i do these braid outs because after i wash my hair it's just an easy go to style and plus when i let it go let it out let it loose let it do what it do it gives me this crinkly curly hairstyle that i love like i really love it like it gives you this fullness okay so the first thing that i do is i wash my hair with this this is cantu grapeseed strengthening shampoo with grapeseed oil and shea butter restores and nourishes from the roots to the tips from the rooter to the tutor okay sulfate free also free from paraffins parabens phthalates and mineral oil okay so this is what i use to wash my hair and i like it um it does really well i don't wash my hair that often i wash my hair probably it depends if my hair is really itchy then i'll wash my hair but probably once a month i wash my hair i don't put too much uh products in my hair in the first place okay so this is what i wash it with as well as after i wash my hair and i'm doing a retwist then i will use this indian healing clay or uh, what else do they call it? Bentonite clay, okay? I will use this um, as a deep cleanse on my hair. And if you watched my previous hair video, you know why I use this. Because it just makes my hair more manageable when I was a loose natural, okay? And so this is one of my products that I like to use on my locks. Now, I will say this. You make sure you rinse it out very, very well or it will cause build up in your locks i'm just saying because i don't want you to be like well glass house maya said it's okay to use this in your locks no ma'am no ma'am you can use it but use it and make sure you actually cleaning out your locks because you're gonna have to put apple cider vinegar in there and that kind of helps remove build up you know you've seen the videos and then i retwist with this tropical roots uh firm locking gel i've tried retwisting with just water in the beginning with just water and uh aloe vera gel that did not work for me i needed something with some hold so i found this firm locking gel i did my research um this is with pineapple and guava and it's extra firm hold okay and it says for braids, locks, and twists. So this is the product that I use to twist my locks at the time. Now, I do have this new product. Well, let me not show you that yet. Because I got two things that's new. 
but I'm gonna let you see that last, okay? Um, the other thing I do when I don't retwist after shampooing my hair, I will go in with a hot oil treatment. And I always use these packets. It's like three packs of Queen Helene hot oil treatment restores shine, all right? And it's for dryness and over-processed hair. But I still use this on my locks every now and then when I want to restore some moisture back into my scalp, okay? So that's Queen Helene's Cholesterol High Oil Treatment. The other things that I use is this, okay? A spray bottle. Get you one. And this one miss out, all right? But water. Your hair needs water, okay? Nothing grows without water. And it's a lot of people on here, I know. They get their fresh retwist, they get their fresh retwist, and they don't want to put water on their hair because they know. If you're like me and you got that faux C, extra kinky, crispy, crunchy, peanut buttery hair, you don't want to wet your hair because you know it's going to roll up like taco meat. You know it's going to curl up. So, you don't want to wet it, but I'm telling you, spray water on your hair on a daily basis, okay? That's what's going to open your hair and cause it to close back up. So, it's kind of like uh, contract and retract. So, if you want your hair to kind of lock faster, you may want to put water on your hair every day because then your hair opens and then it tightens once it's dry. And that's going to, to me, to me... That's my opinion. Don't come for me, all you locked individuals. Um, but water, okay? Put water on your hair. I also use this rose water and glycerin, okay? By Heritage Store, I get this on Amazon. Um, now, if I don't spray water, I spray this. And this is empty. So, this tell you I use this. I need some more. I need to go order me some more. But this is vegan and cruelty-free, free of dyes and alcohol. So, rose water and glycerin. Also to add moisture to your hair. Um, the other things that I use on my hair, I rarely use this, but I do use this. It's a leave-in conditioner. Now, I don't spray this as often. And I try not to spray it on my actual ends of my locks. I spray it on the scalp. Okay, so it kind of moisturizes and conditions my scalp versus the full length of my locks. So this is Allocate Naturals. Um, she is a YouTuber and she sells her products, I know for sure, in Target. But this is the Lemongrass Leave-In Conditioner. And then oils that I use. I found this Omla Oil. I found this Omla Oil um on a website that I shopped online, like a beauty supply store. And it's Silkening All Mist, Revive Shine on Fine to Medium Hair. It is Indian Omla Oil. And I just spray this on my hair to add some shine, okay? Um, now these three things right here, okay? These next three products are products that I use on my hair all the time all right for itchiness for uh moisture and i mix these three things together the first thing is avocado oil and what avocado oil does for me it silkens my hair it softens my hair it makes it smooth it makes it manageable been using this since i was a loose natural and i've been natural since 2011 okay out here in these streets Avocado oil, but I didn't know about this back then. I didn't know about this till like four or five years ago. This right here, avocado oil, get you some. And then the next thing I use, which I use for multiple purposes, is this aloe vera 100% gel by Fruits of the Earth. And when I tell y'all we go through this, we go through this because it's so good for your skin, um, like if you have any skin irritation, this gonna, this gonna clear it up. Okay. 
my youngest son is allergic to mosquito bites. And so when he gets bit by mosquitoes, you know, it leaves these large welts on him and it's, it's, it's itchy. This here, this stuff right here will stop it. Okay. I won't use another aloe vera gel other than this. Okay. This has no alcohol in it. It's just pure, uh, aloe vera gel. Okay. Moisturizer for sunburn or dry skin, but I use this on my hair too. So the last thing, well, it's not the last thing. I got two new products, but that I'm going to try, but, um, and I used to be such a product junkie. I used to have so much stuff, but I realized I don't need all that stuff in my hair. You know, I have learned to use what works instead of going out and trying this, that, and that, and this, and this, and that, and that, and this, and okay trying all these different products that and then i have like a shitload of stuff that your girl really don't need so this right here <laughs> some of y'all are gonna have a fit but i use this in my hair it is sulfur 8 medicated hair and scalp conditioner okay it's for dandruff which i don't have dandruff in my hair but i use this for itching Okay, when my scalp starts itching, which is not very often, but it does when I put too many products in there. Or um, sometimes the edge control makes my scalp very irritated. But, sulfur so 8. Okay, so what I do is I'll take all three of these products and mix them together and create like this creamy loose because it be loose because of the aloe vera creates like this creamy loose like gel almost and then i put this on my scalp i just go through and i grease my scalp basically with these three products mixed together and that gives me the moisture that gives me the the control of itching that i need and then finally okay the last two things well this one isn't new but i just started using it again because once this is gone, I'm not going to rebuy this again. So I, I've always, I have always used pink luster, even the lotion kind. But this is a glosser. It's like a shine. So it adds shine and eliminates frizz for natural and relaxed hair. Okay. Um, it's made with aloe, shea butter, jojoba oil. Okay. This is what I spray on my hair. This is what I used to spray on my hair when I was natural. And it just gave my hair like this. Woo! I sprayed some on there this morning. Okay? Um, but it just gives your hair like this shine. Um, this one kind of like soaks in faster. But this here, uh, you know, kind of gives it like a longer lasting shine. So this, I'm glad I re-bought this. Um, but yeah, pink luster glosser. Okay? And then I found this. So I was perusing, perusing through the pages of Wally World online. My stomach growling. And I found this. It is Sulfur 8. Here we go. Don't come for me. Sulfur 8 Lock and Twist Braid Gel. Okay, I haven't used this yet. I, th I, just, I didn't even know. I didn't even know this even existed, okay? Um, like I said, I was just browsing online with walmart.com. And this is alcohol-free, non-flaking, long hold control with wheat protein. So I didn't even know Sulfur 8 made lock and braid gel. But it says it holds your locks, twists, and braids gentle but tight. Great for natural hair and extensions. Contains no alcohol and no flaking. So the next time that I do a retwist, I will do a product review with this product. And I will use this and let y'all know how it turns out. The gel is clear. It's clear. Okay. Um. So, yeah. If it's anything like... 
this grease that I use and it helps in the same way. I think it might work, but I'm gonna try it and I'm gonna let y'all know. So that's gonna be it for this video. If you have any products that you use in your hair, your favorite products, list them down below in the comments. All right, share this lock journey with your girl and share this video with somebody who's locked. Um, share it on your social media. I thank you for watching this video. I thank you for being here. Okay. And let me know how. Let me know how long you have been locked. If you're on this channel because of locks. Or just because you just love your girl. You just love seeing my face. Okay. Um, just let me know. Let me know in the comments. Alright. You got to comment so we can have a conversation in this thing. Alright. But anyways. I will holler at you in the next video. Peace.